but has caused this gruesome affliction. The local government's Ministry of Defense Hello, erected everyone, a quarantine wall shortly life. after the outbreak. The global the relief effort's steady stream of supply drops has sustained um, what few survivors remain in the city. This is dying light. The Ministry of Defense the, uh, believes more radical game. action should be taken to stem Zombie the tide of this virus. The question is, are there still non-infected survivors in the city as the GRE maintains? And if so, what's will the ministry here? still go through with a stated the plan to annihilate the city the first video in an attempt to wipe out the so Haran virus the dying light. once and for all? Whether by way of the and, uh, virus or the ministry's proposed plan, one thing is certain. Haran's days are numbered. All right, guys, this is Dying Light. Um, this is my first attempt at the campaign. I've never actually played this before. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically try to campaign out. I'm going to do the first video here. Uh, it's probably only going to be about maybe 8 to 13 minutes or so. And uh, we'll see how it goes. Activated. Commence briefing. Approaching Haran. Data on the subject. Kadir Suleiman. A local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. His brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject. The stolen file. In 10 seconds. It details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the virion's structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us, with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE-issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. Alright guys, this is the intro video that I am falling into right now. Hopefully I don't die. Okay, I'm stuck on something. If I can get off. Okay, here we go. I told you that wasn't a normal drop shoot. Break his legs, then take him to rides. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them! Fall back! Fall back! Yeah. <laughs> 
What the hell is going on? Oh, that dude's fucking serious shit. Hey guys, we're going to try to uh, figure this out real quick. Um, apparently Amir was her friend and uh, he just got eaten by about a dozen zombies. So uh, we're going to try not to have that happen. Uh, <laughs> we're going to try not to get eaten. Let's see how well that goes. You pinch him. You're scared. I'm not scared. Then pinch him. He blinked. What? He blinked again. What if he's a zombie? Ah! Zombie, run! <sighs> Shit, my head. That definitely makes you dizzy. Look at that though, look how nice that is. Like all of it just, the entire setup is very beautiful. You're gonna see everything down there. All right guys, well, uh, I'm gonna leave uh, this to the first one right here uh, as the intro, and uh, we'll be right back with the uh, second part. So, take care. <laughs> 